Um, we're going to be starting off on Tower of Heaven. Another classic! What do you know? Mm -hmm. uh, actually, no, this wasn't in the original game. No kidding! It well, was, I it have was no idea what I'm talking about, so... Uh, the original stages were Air Armada, Treetop Lodge, Fire Capital, Rock Wall, and Merchant Port. Only five. Huh. And, uh, you, the there, more was, you there, know. Was, there was no stage select. It was always random. We ran tournaments like this. We just random. We just did random stages. With, yeah, that's, uh, that seems not ideal for running yeah. tournaments. Um, well, thank you, Dan. Thanks, Dan, for, uh, stage making that select. not be the case. Oh, God. Um, apparently there's a Throne Orc cult Discord server that got created, and I am just concerned. I'm not, uh, I'm I'm not worried I'm about it. Oh, my God, I've never seen that before. He dies anyway. Wait, what just happened? Okay, Slip, you know how Orc Kings uh, do the droplet or oh. the level <laughs> reverts, and they do a side B instead and they die? Uh, Sonic, yeah. he threw out a fireball, and it saved Slip. From that, from uh, that FP, and then converted you know it anyway. Maybe Slip was playing that 5D chess, but just uh, didn't quite pan out for them. Yeah, Sonicun really running this. Sonicun actually more of an old school player than you than you might realize. Has been, just doesn't play a lot. Like it, their hours have been stretched out like over a very very long period of time. So. Yeah, but obviously making a pretty strong case for themselves right now, doing a great job controlling, uh, getting big combos, slip so close to losing the second stock. I feel like a lot of Zetters would have Orcane as their best matchup. It just feels natural to play for some reason. Probably because of the first two characters. They, they ah, were, there it is. And probably specifically tailored them to have an even matchup. Like when he was first developing the game. Uh, Yin and Yang. Orcane and Zetter. Um, yeah, right now, <laughs> right there, it kind of just felt like Sonic Goon was just swinging with those up smashes. Ooh, Ooh it actually pays a price. Yeah, GameStop trade. <laughs> GameStop trade, but, uh, not a lot of money, uh, being made off of it. I don't know where I'm going with that joke. I don't know, it's got 192 right now. I want to, Sonic Goon's going to want to sell this real, real soon. Cash it in. Good parry, gets that down strong, and now we are back to an even game. Oh, I like it. Both of them have a part of the stage that they're controlling with their uh, down special. Mm -hmm. Ah, there you go. Parallels. I got that up strong. Probably wouldn't have killed Zetterburn's midway, so yeah. Would have killed Rasta for sure. Uh, I like this string that we were seeing there from Sonic Goon. Kind of struggles to actually get slip off the stage after it, though. Um, here it is. Edgeguard gets the reversal, and now Sonic Goon... Very high recovery, gets punished with down strong. Still alive, though. Oh, uh, slip fishing now. Uh, they are playing Orcane, so, you know. Hate to see it. <laughs> oh, Bubble oh, Butt. Okay, yeah, that's hard to DI. You don't really expect that. Um, yeah, so that was kind of an awkward catch. Uh, Slip kind of just saw Sonic Goon land on the platform and just was kind of ready to catch it out with that bubble butt. So I really can't blame Sonic Goon for not having the DI ready for that. Um, anyways, we're gonna be getting started with game two, going to Merchant Port. Um, I've always thought of this as like the classic Zetterburn um, Merchant Port, but I also don't really know what I'm talking about. Um, <laughs> I, I, always, I just think like you get so much mileage out of having all those platforms to move around with. Um, but right now, Slip is uh, saying counterpick be damned, getting 104%. So close to taking this stock already uh, in the first, you know, 20 seconds of the game. Yeah, Slip feeling really comfortable in this stage. It is, it is or Kane's home field advantage after all. Yeah, down strong. Um... Yeah, Orcane seems to get a lot of mileage out of this, uh, this stage when it's not burning and on fire. Mm -hmm. Yeah, uh, when you're, <laughs> when you're when, oh, Orcane actually uh, really likes a stage that's on fire. That's his favorite one. That's true. a little bit of irony in there. Isn't oh, it? what a recovery! That side be wow. barely clicked on. I mean, it's the most basic set of inputs to do, but the decision making to just side B is really nice. Yeah. Um, Sonic Goon still ends up taking that stock, though, but yeah, Slip has been playing this, uh, this stage very, very well. 
Yeah, Bubbles can cover that platform, so it kind of negates Zetter's recovery advantage of having a, a platform close to the edge like that. Yeah, down strong, not gonna kill quite yet. Good back air! I do like that. Whew, see ya. And that hits up there, too. Yeah, and that is, uh, if memory serves correctly, one of the most powerful uh, strong attacks in the game, so. Yeah, it might be the most. Yeah. Let's see. Back to a bit of, uh, I feel like we're getting a little bit of spaghetti here. Just a little bit. Both these players, uh, well, not spaghetti. Both these players are making good trades, but obviously Slip is still a stock up, so they get a lot of mileage out of trading percent. Oh, wow. Great edge guard. That's just, it's just really good play. Outskilled, unfortunately, for Sonic Goon. Yeah. It seemed like Sonic Goon was actually trying to recover onto the platform uh, and ended up, like, drifting out towards the edge. But it really doesn't matter in that case. Slip has that up strong on deck and was more than willing to let that thing rip. Uh, game three going to be going to Spirit Tree. Um, you know, this is one of those classic... Um, Oh, actually, no, 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 this is, a uh, excuse me, Sonic Goon's counterpick. Mm -hmm. Um, it's a pretty my good guess is, yeah, you kind of just get a lot of mileage out of getting, uh, in advantage state. Not a lot of places for your opponent to actually land, so kind of just can get good damage, but obviously it is a double-edged sword, and Slip has done a good job of getting a good amount of damage out of their advantage state as well, so... Yeah, there's that ignited F strong. A lot of damage slip. Gotta make it back to the center stage. Does get a good hit in neutral, but. I see! Oh! <laughs> the, <laughs> the cacophony of down smash. Yeah, pretty much. Everybody's just. Uh, everybody was down smashing. That's Fire last smash, 2015. <laughs> um. Back to an even game, both these players on their second stocks, but uh, it definitely feels like Slip just has so much momentum from this set so far. Good up air, not quite enough to kill, but it is getting very, very close. Yeah, this damage is starting to really rack up here for uh, Sonic Goon, actually. Oh um, my god, that recovery was good, but Slip just hard reads it. That sucks. Sonic Goon does a really unique recovery for basically the first time in the set. And Slip's just like, yeah, but what, what if I throw an up smash? Oh, but what if, what if Ooh, Sonic Goon has another catch? one? <laughs> yeah, Sonic said, I got some up smashes as well. Gets a very nice stock there. See. All right, last stock here on Spirit Tree. Anything can happen on this stage, honestly. Yeah, again, oh, it, you just get so much mileage out of being at it. Oh. Mm -hmm. Yeah, that'll uh, that'll actually do it. <laughs> Zetter or Orkan going back and forth, huh? Well, I've got a... This matchup brings back the memories for me. Uh, Rivals was at Genesis 5, and it was at Genesis 4, but at Genesis 5, they let Rivals have a, a block on the big stage on Sunday. And the first set there was uh, LBO and Dolphin Brick playing Zitterburn versus Orkane, and it was a good set. Nice, nice Zitterburn Orkane memories. Yeah, Rivals lore. There you have it. I actually love that. Um, yeah, this matchup, uh, I feel like. You just had your Ratatouille moments watching this matchup, um, where it gets like the zoom out and you just remember the old days, Genesis 5. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> uh, we're going to be getting started with game number four here, though. Sonic Goon manages to sneak in and find that game three, but I, I, I will be entirely honest, it wasn't a convincing win. Slip kind of just uh, SD'd. Yeah. I still feel like, uh, yeah, Slip is, is doing a good job in this matchup. Yeah, but we're gonna get that started uh, right now. Game four, Gates. Uh, pretty okay. Orkane stage, I think, is up front can actually reach these platforms, which is kind of kind of crazy. Yeah. Um, want to be able to get those stocks? Yeah, I, I do agree with this kind of pick as well. I think this is a, a solid choice. To slip. All is in Sonic Goon's court. If they are not able to take this game, then. Uh, it will be curtains for their run, but Slip has been playing so well through the set. It is, uh, 
This might be a bit of a tricky win for Sonic Goon to get. You know, top three in this uh, this bracket is uh, the person who stream I watched and two people from my pool. So if you ever want to do good in the bracket, uh, hit me up. <laughs> Evidently, just play in MSB's pool and uh, you will find success. If I have to perceive you, you will automatically do better in your endeavors. <laughs> just uh, go to MSB and touch his, touch his cloak and you'll be good. <laughs> no, um... <laughs> Yeah, right now Slip is, again, just controlling this game. Um, it's been, uh, again, it's pretty rough for Sonic Goon. Yeah, this not is... not able to find these conversions. This is considered by some to be Zetterburn's worst stage. Uh, the reason for that is his up tilt now smash don't reach the platform, which is huge, and the blast zones are very large, so Zetterburn wants to kill, and he can't be, he can't do it on this, on this stage sometimes. Like, there, he can't up strong because the platforms don't work. Yeah, and even that damn strong could have been DI'd, so even that shouldn't have killed. Yeah, this is is very much does feel like a good stage for Slip, and potentially just like a missed ban from Sonic Goon. Like yeah, it just it's is definitely such a powerful ban. stage. Uh, and also, half the time um, the platforms look like this, and everyone can't even recover to them. Yeah, you just have to go straight towards ledge, and Slip Great will tech. have these hitboxes ready. Bubbles not going to be able to find anything, but you have so much damage on Sonic Goon, and you are already stock up. Yeah, just one big hit from Slip is all they need. Okay. okay. Back here. Oh, read the jump. Slip read a jump there, but ends up getting a dance mission anyway. So, one interaction I wanted to point out there. Uh, congratulations to Slip in the Grand Funds. One interaction. You saw that when Sonic Goon tech slips up smash, he kind of just got jabbed off anyway, right? So Sonic yeah. still Sonic Boom still had air dodge there. So what you can do is you can cancel all of your wall techs into a double jump or an air dodge. So when that happens next time, if you're in that situation, cancel the wall tech into an air dodge angle downwards into the stage. You will basically do an invincible ledge dash. The tech in the invincibility from teching carries over to your wavelands. 